Yeah, um, I'm Sonic Boom from Spectrum and EAR. Yeah, for us, uh, the sound check is kind of the, the shortest amount of time where we can know that everyone can hear what they need to hear. Um, and not really, you know, we don't play songs through or we'll only play a short section of them so that we, we know how that should sound to each other. If it sounds like that in the first 10 seconds, it's going to sound like that in the last 10 seconds. So, yeah, we'll, after 10, 15 seconds, we'll usually stop, check everyone's happy, and then go and eat dinner. I think the more, you're hap the more assumptions you have that the sound will be good at the gig, the more likely you are to be disappointed, because the sound changes a lot between sound check and the gig, sometimes from mis by mistake, and sometimes just because that's the way it works. Um, but of course, if you have high expectations that it's gonna sound a certain way and it doesn't, it can be really, um, you know, just off-putting and it's not really, a good vibe to be going into something with. I think sometimes as well, people have this thing about repeating themselves, you know, and so they'll do something really great in the sound check, and then at the gig, they don't want to be repeating themselves, you know, although of course, really, that's what they should be doing, but there's some weird thing. People don't want to be obvious, you know, 